I just want to show you all a Zara haul. Things I got from Zara. Zara. Yeah, so things I got from Zara. Um, they had a big sale going on by the Zara. It's not too close to my house, but it's close. So this shirt, these shirts were these shirts was $10.90. And I got two of those, which is like this tan color. Tan beige, I don't know, color. And the green one there. I got these two beautiful purses. Um, that one was $25. This one was $35. I got these shoes. They were on a sale. Uh, for 49 I don't know like, yeah so they were on sale for 49 uh, this cute shirt here it's kind of made like this one but it had the ruffles on the shoulders and this one was $15 and like 50 cents or something and then I wanted to get some uh, shorts from them but it was a long of a line. I couldn't try it on. The, the fitting room was closed, so I didn't purchase theirs. But I was walking in the store, right? And I seen these at Walmart. And they fit so pretty. And guess what? They was like 11 bucks. How can you do that? I'm going to do it all like that. Um... Whichever shirt I decide, I don't know. And then throw my jacket on. That's a fit. Or I got some uh, sandals upstairs that's like this color that I could even do these with this, with those color sandals. Or that with the white shirt with them color sandals upstairs. Let me go get the sandals to see how close of a match they are. Hold on. Okay, I was wrong. They don't go with that. It's the shoes are a little bit darker. I got those shoes from either Carson's or Macy's. I don't remember. But yeah, and I got them like last year or something. But um, yeah. So that is it. That I got. Yeah. So yeah, that is it. I thought it went, but it really didn't. The shoes, but uh, yeah, it's cute. So these is how the pants fit that I got from Walmart. They are so freaking cute, and they were only eleven bucks. But yeah, so. And then busy, I hate it. He can put all type of fingerprints up on my mirror. You know what he be doing, it's cool. So I know how I look, cause I'm finna go donate some clothes and I'm finna go wash some clothes. And yeah. Yep, so these is at Walmart and I got them for 11 bucks. They hold all the baby fat in. Oh, baby, I look so raggedy. Whatever.
time I'm gonna drink this laying down. Not gonna happen. Hold up. Hey, y'all. Uh, so I'm back. Did I introduce myself? I'm beautiful. Hey, y'all. So I'm just taking this stuff out the grocery store. Hey, to show y'all my little grocery store home. I just said, you know, first. Because I had a lot of time. So, went to Walmart. I got some spinach for tonight's dinner. Bread, the wine sweet bread, the happy looking cream. I got some the cup noodles, the hot and spicy cream, my chicken right there, bananas, and I wanna try these and never try these before. But I got these, the probiotic dailies. I love those anyway. I got the triple cheese for what I'm making tonight. Um, planet oat milk. B, what you doing? <laughs> B. He don't want me to talk to y'all. Okay. So, the planet oat milk. The extra creamy. Bitches gonna cut up on these, y'all. That made me and y'all. Anywho, I got the planet oat extra creamy i like this because this works very well like if you're trying to father your milk bars uh, with your coffee or your matcha you know the little foam that goes on top yeah that's really good for that um i got my simply lemonades the blueberry raspberry and i got the kids some juicy juice and my cup also got some milk and what else yeah, so that's it because everything else I've got. And yeah, that's it. But it's going to be low energy with high impact. I want you to take the time to pour back into your own cup so that you can discover what excites you, what moves you, and who you are. You are a gift to the world, and it is time for us to unwrap it. Find out all the information you need to know about the first ever Woman Evolve course at womanevolve.com. All right, ladies, so you heard from her first. Y'all ready? 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 Y
when I got invited out, I said, you know, this would be something new. I never went to like a like a, a church conference or like uh, I don't know what it's called, the Revolution Tour. So um, I went there, me and a couple of more uh, ladies, and we had an awesome, awesome time. Uh, forgive me, I did not hear about like Sarah James, like I said, until then when she invited me out so when I got there and just to find that uh she's one of the people I look up to daughter T.D. Jake's daughter I'm like what the heck have I been I don't know but I'm glad I did uh find out about her she's very inspirational things she spoke about were like so profound it was almost like she was talking directly to me like as if she was like, you come here, let me talk to you. <laughs> so I took everything in, um, just a lot of things that I had like been praying about, you know, worried about or feared about. And like I said, it was just like, God just used her in that place. And I'm glad he did because I felt blessed with that. And um, that's part of why I haven't been like on my YouTube channel for like the last week, two or something like that. Um, I had to get some things together within myself so that I can be prepared for my next. So um, with that being said, I do have my website opening up very, very soon. Um, I do have the giveaway, the $100 giveaway for when I reach my 100 subscriber. Um, and yeah, it's, uh, oh, so with, so with the giveaway, I will be giving away, um, products from my store. So just make sure you all tune in and whatever you think about, dream about, do it. Uh, don't let nobody tell you that you can't, don't stop, just keep going, encourage the next person to keep rooting and um i have learned like a lot like when people see you um they they're so used to the level that you work on and so when they see you walking into your new it's almost like you can't be proud of yourself because they will take it as you being boastful or you in competition or um you know try to make yourself up here and nobody's in and they're below you but what i came to realize is that i have to be exactly who god called me to be and whoever may feel like a certain way when they come in my presence, just because I have something that I'm proud of, I'm not trying to intimidate the next person or make no one else jealous or envy. I just know that because what I eat don't make the next person shit, what they eat don't make me shit. Excuse my language, but I mean, but with that being said, I'm just, I'm, I'm going to remain focused. Um, I pray that you do the same. Stay focused. Uh, pray. Just pray. A lot of times, like, when I used to pray, I was leaving myself out of prayer. Like, I would pray for everything, everybody around me. And I seen those things getting blessed. And when I was going, I felt like I was going yonder, like, and it, it got to a point where I was like, dang, God, like, are you forgetting about me? Like, you know, what what happened? I thought I'm supposed to pray for others, but yeah, I'm supposed to pray for others, but what about me? You know, um, I probably have like a good four people that probably would genuinely pray for me and with me. Like, so I had to just start praying for myself you know and um 
just keeping myself encouraged and with that being said like i hope that i could inspire somebody like one day or like be inspirational um even to my daughters my daughter's friends and you know it just start because young young people look up to you as well like those are your biggest watchers you know just encourage women that you know some things that i went through i could relate to or things that i didn't go through that i would still try to pray for the next person for their healing or you know the next or whatever it is it was so profound like within these last two weeks i'm glad that i was able to work on me and getting me together so yeah so with that being said the giveaway is approaching you guys i am so happy i um i am like above 90 some subscribers so so uh yeah it'll happen soon and as soon as it happens i'm gonna package up that little packet send it off to the winner make sure you go back and look at some of my videos i'm gonna do like a like a little like a game almost i should have did a get to know me video a while ago but it's cool yeah so my next um few videos so i had to get i had to get my camera and my laptop together because they act like they don't want to work together or something. I don't know why they don't want to work together, but they got to work together. So I had been, I've been like blogging and capturing things off my phone when I have a camera that I would love to use because of the uh, video quality. So, yeah. Oh, so my Instagram account i am changing over to not it's not going to be like a personal page it's going to be more of a business page because i really don't post nothing anyway i really don't even be on instagram but now since i have my company excuse me now since i have my company i can post that on my social media platform so um so on my TikTok, I was thinking about doing more so of uh, makeup in that area. Like, but like on my YouTube, I want to do like all everything. So Instagram, my business. Um, TikTok might be part of my business too. Like, I don't know. Right now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit down and focus on that and jot down which is which one i want to be which i mean if you all have like an idea on how to structure it let me know down below um yeah so it was good talking to you all hopefully you all stay prayful i'm gonna pray for you all um send lots of blessings your way um i'm gonna encourage you to pray today this week whatever and um yeah we gonna be back on this thing back on these videos so like um uh, my videos are going to be like home videos vlogs related around beauty um and all of that stuff so just basically seeing the world through my eyes i guess i could say <laughs> So yeah, thank you all for all your like, comment, subscribing. Thank you all for your support. Share this video, share the other video, and thank you for watching.